the best way to pass someone else's guard without you, right? Using that knee across. So just to like to play with the with the my opponent reaction. So I give something to rethink about it before I go to the move, right? So I'm gonna start here, the same position. I'm gonna look for the under hook here. Put his leg on my shoulder. So now he don't know if I go across or if he's still gonna come this way, right? I'm gonna block his hip right here. So I make a little pressure on here and don't go straight with my knee to the mat. But probably my opponent don't wanna let that knee reach the mat because he knows that we're gonna do problem for him. And then if the knee he blocks, I come with the knee across and go for the head. I'll be a little safe to the guy that will go to my back, right? So right here in the beginning, we start here, I look for the underhook, block his leg, right? Stand up that knee right here, I'm gonna put the knee across and block, come with the other knee, you don't come to my back and it's there, grab the head, do the way from here, so I can see here. And then from here, you can just decide which way you wanna go. But a couple key points of it, as you, as you come into it, as Dean already said, you can't have this arm down here. My arm against his leg is a loser. Okay? I gotta get it all the way up onto my shoulder. This, this other leg, if I just put it all the way over, it's not as solid, you can start moving his hip more. So I keep my foot over and trapped. Once I get him here, I actually like to do a little, uh, little, little movement right there, just to try to bring him in, I can stretch him out. And it really sucks, you have to be on the bottom. And then I'll just kind of decide, I usually will just push, boom, Nice and deep, nice across the side position. From here, make them knee themselves in the face. <laughs> so, so once again, we're here, for whatever reason, the, guy's, the guy gives up his leg or you reach under and get his leg. Again, what happens if you do this? What happens if your elbow's down on his leg? You're just gonna trying to help him on. So it's, it's the elbows inside his leg, you're here. Knee and elbow together, get that thing up on top, boom. From here, feel the good control you have. You can pause, you know, not all day, but you can definitely feel which way you want to go. You can go the other way. If he was to take his, his hand and start pushing my hip over there, like to stop me, no problem, I'm gonna come here. So either way. But just feel the control from this position, guys. It's a, it's a nice position to get into. And then from there, you can just pass. Either way you want to go. Boom. Give it a shot, it's called the humiliator. All right, guys, here for it. <laughs> 